Hey you guys, it's Matt Cox here and I wanted to let you guys know what I was doing on the true crime front. Kind of, you know, the whole, the grind, uh, what I've been doing. And, I, and I've been doing a bunch of stuff that, you know, I, I went to California. I met with a bunch of uh, um, producers and I met with a guy named uh, Davey uh, Rothbart. And I wanted to let you guys know basically what I'm doing. I mean, obviously there's a, there's a lot of different things that are going on and I, and it's funny how secretive these guys are, but one of the things I talked to Davey uh, about was we were talking about putting together a, what's called a, a, basically like a true crime podcast where I would be going over all the stories of the guys that I met in federal prison. And so it looks like it, it, it may be called Coleman's finest. So it would be Davey and I, uh, we would be the host and we would be going over, uh, you know, just the different stories that I wrote while I was in federal prison. The name of the production company that we're working with is Campside Media and they basically would be producing a podcast, like a, an audio podcast. It would consist of uh, Davey and I talking about the different stories that, that I wrote while I was in prison. And there would be, let's say, I'm not sure exactly yet. You We've know, done what's called a deck, and they're about to produce. Well, I mean, I guess we're about to produce, I'm assuming. I mean, they said I'm going to be on the call and everything, whatever. We'll see. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, they're they're going to start pitching it to various, uh, you know, various streaming networks where, you know, like, I don't know, iTunes or, or is it Spotify or, you know, I, I'm not even, I'm not even positive who, I'm not, not even positive who, who you pitch it to. I mean, we've, we've talked about it and stuff, but you know, it's been going on and on and we've been shooting, you know, ideas back and forth. And so we'll see, we'll see what happens. Um, it's, it seems like it's coming together. Uh, you know, we put together this, this thing and it breaks down like the different stories that we would be potentially going over and the format and, and how it would play out and actually talking to uh, some of the some of the uh, guys that I I wrote stories on and so that's it I mean that's it's a I think it's pretty cool and I, I wanted to let everybody know and that you know look I'm, I'm not just sitting around painting and, and making videos I mean I'm I'm actively doing other things I, I actually have meetings with a couple other production companies on a couple of my other stories and uh, I'm working on getting some documentaries made and getting some sizzle reels done and and I'm working just with with various uh, people in the in the industry and right now true crime is like huge so uh, you know I, I actually just got off the phone with a, a guy that was talking about doing my story which which I haven't even pushed my story and he was he was talking about uh, possibly you know you know we could do this we do that and we went over a bunch of different things and so that may or may not happen I don't know I'm gonna you know I, I pursue them and you know they fizzle out or I don't feel good about it or they start screaming for me to sign something that I don't feel comfortable with and you know it's it's you know look if it's gonna happen it's gonna happen if it's meant to happen. You know, the, the, I think that the pieces will fall into place and I'm not unreasonable to work with, but you know, guys want you to sign a two, you know, 24 month shopping agreement, which is, which is outrageous. I mean, it's funny too. This is what's so funny is that they all start the same way. They're all, they all say the same thing, which is, you know, we already knew, know who we're going to bring it to. We're totally, you know, pumped about this. It's a great idea. We put that, we've already talked, I've already talked to my team. They always say they have a team. I don't know what that means. Well, you know, I talked to my team about it. We're excited about it. We've already, we already know where we want to bring it. We've already talked to the production company. We're ready to go. They're already interested. They already uh, want to make an offer. We know what the, what the offer is. We feel good about it. Go ahead and sign this. We need 24 months to shop it. You just got done telling me it's basically sold. It's a done deal. They're, they, and they'll throw numbers out there and everything. It's like, well, you said you talked to these people. They've already looked at this stuff. You're ready to go. They're ready to sign. So if they're ready to sign, why do you need 24 months? You go in there. You pitch it. They say they're interested. We negotiate a, a, an agreement. It's over. 
you need 90 days. Now, and, and I, I've had this argument with these guys, and it's, it's hilarious. It's hilarious because, like, they're, they, I guess they think they're going to get me so excited that I'm just going to sign something. And when, when it doesn't actually make sense, uh, I, I just, it's just not going to, it just doesn't work that way with me. It, it has to make sense. There's no reason not to explore things without signing something. And so, you know, I'm, I've been working on it, but, but this is the thing that I'm working on with, uh, with Davey Rothbart and it's, it's worked out great. It's working out great. I, I like all the guys that I'm working with. You know, it's a scaled down version from, let's say, like a Netflix series, which obviously is my end goal would be a Netflix series. But, you know, I'm pushing the actual stories, the, the stories I wrote, like I'm pushing like John Boziak and I'm, I'm pushing Donovan Davis and I'm, I'm pushing, you know, Pete Rossini's story and I'm, I'm, I'm pushing, you know, Frank Amadeo's story. Those are the stories I'm pushing and I'm not really pushing my story because I don't even know why. Maybe I should be pushing it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. That's uh, that's pretty much it. That's where I'm at. I'm using the camera on my phone. And I'm thinking, I'm hoping it picks it up. I got a new phone. So I'm hoping it's picking up my, the audio's good and uh, that the lighting's good. I got like a ring light thing here. So um, yeah, so we'll see how this video, I just wanted to give everybody an update to, you know, it's not like I'm, it's not like I'm not pushing uh, the stories and I'm not doing stuff. I actually have things in motion. The problem is, like, if you start getting things in, you'll, you know, you start doing things and you're meeting with people and, and they don't want that. One of the one of the things, first things they basically tell you is like, don't post any social media. Don't do this. Don't do that. It's like, why? It doesn't even make sense. But but they all seem to be doing it. I mean, except for you know, Davey was like, yeah talk about it yeah, do a video it doesn't matter like I never even asked him because I thought he was going to be the same way he's like nah it's fine so anyway we've got a deck we're we're gonna be pitching the deck soon and pitch the show soon and everybody feels good about it and they feel confident about it and I feel confident about it and I'm excited and that's pretty much it so do me a favor subscribe to the channel uh, share the uh, share the video hit the like button make sure you hit the notification bell and uh, this is pretty much it. This is a quick video. I just want to give everybody, you know, I'm working on like three different fronts. There's like three different things I'm doing at all time. So, um, you know, I, I, I don't, I haven't really been talking about the true crime stuff. So uh, I wanted to give everybody an update and that's, this is the update. So that's it. I appreciate it. See you.